Hello everyone. Today I will be chopping up the ram and making some barbacoa and also starting the first process of making the shofars. So I'll be making short clips and piecing it together uh, for this video. I hope you all enjoy. And right now I'm cleaning my makeshift butcher table. It's makeshift. Anyways, I'll show you all the progress. Hope you all enjoy and have a blessed day. So I've made a slit right through here. I want to be peeling and cutting to get to remove the skin. This is the second process of the shofar. Let them boil for 10 minutes. Alright. Alright. Now we're supposed to do it. Let's uh, step around. Yeah. But it looked like they had to put a little effort into the twisting. I don't see nothing moving. Yeah. Oh. I just see it turning black. That's what YouTube said. YouTube. <laughs> Can't be wrong if YouTube said it. Right. Yeah, maybe. I don't see it move at all. Mm -mm. Yeah. And again, these are quite a bit bigger than. Yeah, it's turning. Ah. Yeah? It looked like it was. There it is. There it is. Oh, oh. Nice. Wow. Wow, look at that. Alright, let's bang this one somewhere. Well, maybe I gotta go out here more. Now that I see you there. Got his toupee on. Yeah. yeah. See that one moving. It's cooled down though too. <laughs> so this was my next step on cleaning out the shofars. So y'all check it out. Got 
got them in an ant pile. Cleaning them out. Of course, they don't want to focus. Anyways, pretty big, big show for us. But that's, I'll be leaving the ants to clean out the inside of them and we'll go from there. Meanwhile, got the barbacoa got cooking over there. Can't really see it. And the other brother's waiting. So this has been boiling for four hours, getting all the blood out, about to pull it apart, all the meat, shred all the meat apart for barbacoa. Well, I had to find a different ant pile because the original one wasn't very active. So. I found this pile and it seems to be a little bit more active. Hopefully you can see the ants crawling around. But I know you can't see really inside the horn, but uh anyways, it's more active. So I'll let the ants clean it out by eating whatever membrane might be left inside of it. And I'll be leaving this for a couple days before I go on to my next step. Uh, I'm down to one shofar right now because I gave the other one to my buddy and he'll be making a shofar out of his as well. So just wanted to share this is one of my steps of cleaning out the horn to make a shofar my first time. 